So what Chris and I are filming right now is pretty interesting. This tree is producing these really bizarre looking yellow uh, projections. And I don't know if it's a fungus or if it's a fruit produced by the tree. But in any case, we see something really cool. We discovered that these yellow bulbs serve as food to a never before seen caterpillar. But here's where things get even stranger. The caterpillars have evolved a special organ to secrete their own nectar, which attracts ants who happily serve as their personal bodyguards in exchange for the sugary meal. If you look closely, you can see the ant drumming on the caterpillar's back. The caterpillar then secretes a drop of nectar that the ant laps up. Let's watch that again in slow motion. These caterpillars in the family Lysinidae have what's known as the dorsal nectary organ, which produces a liquid cocktail packed with sugars and amino acids. This allows for a symbiotic relationship with the ants known as myrmecophily. The caterpillars provide the sweet nectar, and the ants provide protection in return. After emailing these images to several entomologists and botanists, it became clear that this relationship had never been observed until now. But we were able to get an idea on those yellow bulbs. It turns out that they're not a fungus, but actually a rare parasitic plant that belongs to the family Apodanthaceae. There's not a whole lot known about the biology of this unusual parasite, which spends most of its time living inside the bark of its host plant and then bursts out once a year to flower. In any case, the caterpillars seem to love feeding on these yellow bulbs. While photographing the parasitic plant, we noticed an adult butterfly land on this same tree. What was so surprising was the distinct yellow spot on its wing, which appears to resemble the yellow bulbs. What this suggests to us is that there's an evolutionary relationship between this butterfly, its caterpillars, and the parasitic plant. This is all important because it gives us insight into a previously unknown interaction and can teach us more about the complex biodiversity in the rainforest. A few months later, I made a return trip to this field site. So I am back in the Peruvian Amazon and I'm headed down the same path that will lead me to that bizarre tree that we found just a few months ago. Okay, so I've got some good news and some not so good news. The good news is that we've arrived at our destination and the not so good news is that those yellow parasites on that tree appear to have fallen off. So I don't see any caterpillars or any ants or any butterflies but we know that this is the right spot because we marked this location and also because if you look closely at the tree, you'll notice that there's these sort of scars left in the bark where each of those parasitic bulbs burst out. So it could be that the parasite has receded back into the tree and it may come out uh, at a later time in the year. We'll have to come back and check now. So this is very interesting because it's just a few months later and this complex relationship is no longer present in this spot. So if the parasitic plant has a very short life cycle, then what does this tell us about the life cycle of the butterfly that survives on it? It's really interesting. And it's also a little frustrating because we want uh, to answer these questions, but you know, that's science. And uh, we'll have to be patient and we'll have to keep checking up on this spot uh, if we want to figure out if this phenomenon repeats itself. So we're going to keep on researching this really interesting relationship between a parasitic plant, caterpillars, and ants. And uh, if you have any ideas or any questions of your own, please message us and uh, please subscribe. We're going to keep posting updates the more that we learn. This video was made possible by PeruNature.com. If you're looking to plan your own adventure to the Amazon, follow the links and check out their site where you can book at one of their awesome jungle lodges. Thanks for watching.